Jim. I'm really new to this, as you know, and I'm sitting here watching um, you tape these these questions and answers, and I wonder, how do I get started? What do I buy? I'm looking at all different kinds of cameras. What is this, and what do you like? As far as technology? Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. well, I would just tell you all that whatever Mike Stewart's got, that's what I buy. So if Mike Stewart says this is, I mean, I bought the camera from Mike, I bought the, the, actually I stole the microphone from Mike and told him I wasn't giving it back until he sent me one of my own. And so what, what I do is I find somebody that I trust that I know is going to tell me the right stuff to buy. Mm -hmm. And technology changes. But as this stuff gets smaller, easier, more portable, more high quality, I mean, this is widescreen now. And yeah, it's, it's slick. I know that you're going to have to upgrade the technology about every year or two years. It just is what it is. Two years ago, we were using a flip. Three years, four years ago, we were using a mini DV. And I like to upgrade it because I, I like the latest thing. But what I would tell you is whatever you've got, use it. Mm -hmm. The biggest thing is people buy this technology. They invest in technology. They invest in equipment that they never use. How many people have stuff sitting on the floor sitting in their closet, sitting on their desk, meaning to get to it, wanting to get to it, but never get to it. And the reason for that is because they try to do too many big things too fast. I would rather have you do one two minute video a week and put it on your blog and then mix in a couple tips in an article and do that than to have the best video series that ever never got made which is what most people have done. So my advice to you would be to find some technology that you're comfortable with, that you're looking, I mean, this can't get any easier. Victoria, you hit the button on the back and you start yakking. Mm -hmm. It can't get any easier. So just get whatever you're comfortable with and use it and do something with it, even if it's totally wrong. I would rather you did something totally wrong, something totally that only you and maybe, you have a cat? Not yet. Okay. Do you have a dog? <laughs> Not yet. Okay. Goldfish? <laughs> okay. You and the fish thought was cool, <laughs> but you at least did something, and you're moving forward, and most people don't. Okay. Most what, people don't do what anything. What is this one? What is this one? That's the latest from Mike Stewart. Oh, that's okay. a that's the latest code, Kodak thing. A year ago, it was the ZI-6, and now it's the ZI-8, so by the time you guys see this, it might be the ZI-21. It doesn't matter. It's, it's You just got to jump in, but then once you jump in, I mean, the whole, this whole thing costs under $200. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that might be the Jim Edwards price from Mike, but let's say under $250, $300. Mm -hmm. But once you got it, use it. That, that's just the biggest thing I could tell you, and get something that's simple. You don't need, now you don't, you don't need fire. It used to be you had to hook stuff up with fire wires and all this other stuff. Now it's just, you know, USB, plug it in, pull it out, and do its thing. And the... Um and having this, um, what do you ever call it? Monopod. Monopod. Monopod then makes it so that people can watch it without getting sick. <laughs> right. It just it helps you keep it steady. Yeah. Plus, it's one of those things here. Let me show you. This is something we could do. Hold on. Yeah. All right. You see that? Oh, I love that. Yeah. You do it completely alone. Right. You wouldn't have to have somebody doing that. I mean, it's I don't know if it's straight or not, but it's pretty straight. Mm -hmm. Somebody's helping me. But, I mean, you could, it's oh, doable. I love that. So it, add, it adds to the character, too. So, mm -hmm. and there's, th there's, the biggest thing I want to tell you is just to do it. Just do something. Great. Great. I'll talk to Mike then. Okay, cool. Good.